Dun 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 dun. Next into the tank is your new sunbed for the sea. Dun 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 dun. dun. Hey sharks, I'm Hans Burry from Vero Beach, Florida, and I'm the creator of Sunchill. I'm here asking for $250,000 for 20% of my company. If you're the kind of person who thinks every hour should be happy hour, then I sure have the thing for you. Ugh, no room. Let's get a little serious here. So, Sunchill is an eight foot wide inflatable ring that weighs 18 pounds, packs down small, inflates in two minutes, and weighs, weighs 18 pounds and has no weight limit. It is the perfect place to lay the day away and share a drink with six or seven of your closest friends. We're the portable, durable alternative to floating mats and all the flimsy floats that boaters and water lovers have been struggling with for years. The patent pending sun chill was designed by a boater for boaters to be quickly deployed and easily stored away. The outer ring is made of a heat welded drop stitch and the inner net is a poly pro mesh netting that flexes ever so slightly for a completely relaxing and comfortable experience. Launched in March of this year, I am proud to say I have sold 214 sun chills for $115,000 in revenue with a busy summer to come. Based on the feedback and excitement of these initial customers, I expect to sell another 1,500 to 2,000 units this year alone. I've invested $300,000 of my savings into sun chill and I'm prepared to invest more. This is my baby, this is my life. Your investment in Sunchill will be used to expand manufacturing in America. At present, the bulk of my materials are imported from Asia and all assembly, testing, and quality control are done in my garage right here in Vero Beach. I seek to avoid the tariffs and logistics issues of importing and creating, and I wanna create an American-made product with American labor in an American workshop. I know what equipment I need, I know how much space I need, I know what kind of skills I need from our people. American manufacturing can be done and it should be done. A bit about myself, I spent the last five years traveling the world while working remotely. I was lucky to have visited many, nearly every corner of the world. And then in 2017, I decided to buy a sailboat in Greece and sail it through the Med, down the coast of Africa, across the Atlantic and into the Caribbean. The journey took one year and was more incredible than I can put into words. The concept for Sunchill came to life while living on the boat. And while wishing for a durable, comfortable, and storable solution to relax in the water with my friends, there was nothing for sale. So fast forward to August, 2020, my remote job is no more, the boat is sold, and all I have is this unique idea for the best float the world has ever seen. So check out Sunchill in the next clip. Hey there, so I'm in an unboxing video today with the sun chill here in Vero Beach, Florida. So uh, tune in, might speed through a few areas, but I wanna show you how this thing rocks. I'm about 5'10", so you can see size-wise, it's about from my chest down to my waist, and uh, it comes with a ice carrying handle. This whole contraption here with the pump is about 22 pounds, the sun chill itself is 19 pounds. And uh, let me open it up and show it to you. So, dumps inside here, take the hose off, screw it onto the inflate side. Okay. Here, and then take out the sun chill, which this is our yellow one. And it comes wrapped in a strap, packs down to about uh, 10 inches in diameter, about 20 inches wide. And I'm gonna go ahead and inflate it for us. Take the strap off, put it over here with the bag. And there's a stainless steel D-ring to attach to the side of your boat and the valve here. The valve is the same valve on any standard uh, inflatable paddleboard. And to deflate, you would open it up. To inflate, you pull it out. And now it's not letting any air out. But when I attach the pump, it'll let a bunch of air in. So let's see. Just kind of roll it out. Up there. 
Now, if this was on your boat, you could easily uh, do this over the side, throw the boat over the edge, and hang on here, attach your pump, and go at it. Pump goes on. Pump uh, has a double and a single valve. We're going to use the double, so it's going to pull out more air in for a stroke. And uh, we're going to go for it. It should be about a minute and a half to two minutes of pumping. That took us to 10 PSI. Let's undo that. Put the nozzle back on. There's a, a gauge on the top here. And there's the pump show. So it measures 8 feet in diameter, 7 feet 10 inches. And from here on the inside, it's uh, 6 foot 5 inches. Uh, pretty much as hard as a rock. This part floats. You hop in and you bounce around. And remember to tie off with his earring. Turning her around. We have 24 attachment points and 52 attachment points on the net. So when you jump in, it'll spring with you, but it's flexing at 24 points. So you're not gonna damage anything. You can let the kids jump in it. You can take a dive bomb in if you want. Just enjoy. So now, to deflate, we open up the valve again and push in and turn. And it'll lock it in, which will let all the air out. Since it's at 10 PSI, it's quite a bit of air. So, let nature do its job. And then I like to roll it up. I like to flip it over. Now again, if you're on the back of your boat, depending on how big your transom is, you could keep this end in the water and hold on here. Uh, let's try that. So really, I just give it a couple rolls this way. And then give it a few rolls the long way. The material is really strong, so you don't have to worry about it wrinkling or bending too hard. It's made for this. So, as I'm doing this, I'm squeezing the rest of the air out. As you can see here. There it goes. Now the final squeeze, get a little knee on it. Close the valve. You're back to almost nothing. Throw the strap back on. It's just a regular vinyl strap. Nothing fancy Ooh. here. Get your bag. The bag's a little bit oversized, so it's easy to put it back in. It's not one of those things where it only fits just right. Get your sun chill back in your bag. Unscrew the hose from the pump. Hose back in the bag. Pump back in the bag.
cooler shut. And there you have it. That's the sun chill.